babies Well, perhaps this is the time to stop listening to stories and finally make some of your own. Good night, Gwendolyn. Sleep well. I'm really liking their dynamic. It, it, it seems like he's kind of a mentor to her, but also kind of a, I don't know, almost like a big brother figure. I wonder if she has brothers. Is she an only child? There's so much I want to know. Come in, Gwendolyn. You can set those on the nightstand. Here's your pile of drugs, Grandpa. All Grandma of them. Grandma said to take three spoonfuls of each. Hi, as a kite. Those no need to fuss over me. Now let's talk about far more important issues, like that fencing tournament. I hear you're competing. There are many ways to win a duel. I, for one, have always been fond of. Now, this is an interesting choice. Uh, and, and I believe just time freezes forever. Even though you guys are obviously still alive and blinking here, you can say, you can t basically tell her your preferred method for winning a duel. A deft maneuver, a quick-witted distraction, to, or an act of kindness. Now, from what we know of King Graham, of course, he is benevolent by all stretch, altruistic to a fault. So I don't even think he would want to duel somebody. I think he would just want to sort of talk him down. So as much as I think a quick-witted distraction is the best way to win a duel, I don't think it's the King's Swayze way. An act of kindness in every victory. I wonder how this comes up in the future, I wonder. Treating my opponents with respect. You'll be surprised what opens up to you. A lovely fellow once told me the fastest way to anyone's heart is through their stomach. <clears throat> I wonder who told him that in the past. Is that a callback to something? I can't well, I think of one. you haven't heard before. When I was a much younger lad, before I was a knight, before I'd been to Daventry, and even before I had seen a dragon. It's a tale about a tournament that changed my life. It is a long story, but I shall Who's tell ruling the country time. while he's in here telling stories? Now, this appears to be our first real story. Well, Triumph, this looks as good a place as any to camp for the night. Let's rest up. We have a big day tomorrow. Are you riding a gigantic guinea pig, King Sir Graham? Are you even a sir yet? You're not even a sir yet. You're just Graham. You're not a knight. This is before everything. Before... Oh, dear. Okay, okay. Am I controlling this? Apparently, I am. I can control this. Oh, yep, yep. Okay, keep him alive. Keep him alive. Don't die. Press right and left to not... Oh, that hurt. Okay, everything's fine. I don't think there is a way to die here because before... I, okay, come on down, King Grant. Didn't I see this in Tommy Boy once, or was it Black Sheep? I can't remember. Uh, oh, that's the same tree I hit on the way down last time. Well, at least it slowed my descent into the mud, and pimp moment, foiled. Daventry was just a few miles to the east. I'd read all about its wonders in my travel books. I couldn't wait to check out its famous, fantastical, floating island. So, Daventry is this way, so it means, of course, we've got to go this way. Off the beaten path is always the best. Find... Oh. I think this way of saying, no, <laughs> no, you don't want to go this way. You don't want to go this way. Triumph! How are you doing up there, my little guinea piggy friend? Grandpa! You can't leave Triumph! Don't worry, Triumph can fend for himself. We've been through our share of sticky situations, but he always comes around when I need him most. I have not played up past this point, so this is all new to me, which I like. I'm getting a very Princess Aurora feeling of this, and is he riding a Tauntaun? Duh. It's kind of a mix between Princess Aurora from Sleeping Beauty and the, uh, the evil theme from Star Wars. Aw, oh, he's so cute. He's my favorite. I'm calling you Clem. I could have sworn the Parade of Hopeful Nights was scheduled for the next day. I should have been with them, marching with triumph. It seemed my first few minutes in Daventry were off to a terrible start. So, how did you catch up with them? Um, I guess I blew this horn, because that was the only thing that was available to me, Gwendolyn. Uh oh that odd horn seemed to be missing some sort of mouthpiece. Interesting. All right. Our first little quest. And this is the first one. This looks like it's not going to hold our hand for this one, so we have to find it on our own. However, the wagon tracks do obviously go this way. Now, 
If I were a mouthpiece for a trumpet, where would I be? Probably be in this pile of leaves. Nope. Such a pretty game. So pretty. Let's see. Broken logs always have stuff, but not here. Butterfly. Or is that a leaf? Or is that a bird? That's a bird. That was neither of those things I thought it was. What's wrong with this bird over here? You can't see my mouse, but what? He's just like... His wings are all droopy. He looks so sad. Like he's hugging the... <gasps> bunny! Bunny, 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 bunny. You look just like Tribe. Come here, bunny. Bunny, 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 bunny. Come here. Come here, bunny. Bunny. You're glowing, bunny. You're positively radiant. Who gives you your skin cream? Oh, pretty. Hi there, Daventry. One day, I will rule you. The fact that this is so far away is that... Whoop. What's that? There's something in that bird's nest, and I want it. But... Do I have anything in my inventory? I have... Five Daventry coins that don't yet have my face on it, though, Will. That must be the mouthpiece, but how do I get to it? It's not giving me the option to do anything. Maybe if I go down and climb the tree, maybe? I don't know. He's obviously looking at it. All right. Well, mental note. Remember it's there. Oh, we can go down and around. Okay, so maybe I can just hit the tree from the bottom. Bunnies! Slippers! Slippers! Okay, I can look at it from here. I wondered what those birds needed a toolbox for. How do they get it up there? Oh, that was it. No! No, my no, my stuff! Not my stuff, but it wanted to be my stuff. Can I take the toolbox? Shame. The only two left seem to be a small hatchet. And no, Gwendolyn, before you start asking me thousands of questions about that hatchet, I did not go around using it on everything. Why wouldn't you? That's the first rule of any adventure game. If you have an item, use everything on everything. Like this tree, for example. There was no reason to chop down that perfectly good tree. I disagree. Those birds are obviously thieves and needed to be dealt with very harshly, making them homeless. Alright, well, I didn't see anything back that way that deserved to be chopped. Maybe if I go down this first... And by the way, how did a hammer and stuff float? BT dubs. Are you a frog? I saw a frog. And that's a... Oh, that's a shadow. That's what that is. I was like, oh, devil bird. It's like some sort of winged snake struggling along the... Space bar, dash. Oh, I like that icon down there. I want to use that for something. All right, excuse me, froggy. Um, how do I... Got it, got it, got it. Don't be mad, I got it. Um, there we go. Okay, that was weird, but we made it. Not much of a puzzle, but should have been. Froggy! That wheel seemed freshly broken. Oh, the frog is so cute. I like how he blinks his little eyes separately. Oh, you're not going- oh, you're not scared of me. I was seeing my distance for a reason. Recently broken wheel, eh? Okay. Mental note, remembering this. You will be the one to take me to Oz, I imagine. Stand back, you dirty thieves! What? Oh, ow. Oh, it's just a boy. I'm a man. I don't know where he's from, but it must be hard to pronounce. You know, you should never sneak up on a guy in a dangerous place like- No! Oh! What's wrong with your foot? Probably stepped on a spiniferous thornweed. Don't worry, I got just the fix for that. Tell me, is it more of a... Ow! Or a... Oh! oh. Either way, the Merchant of Miracles has got you covered. But it'll cost you... I... Ah, here it is. I massage this into my skin twice a day. And just look at my little biscuits. Your little bi... Okay, that I really thought... If I didn't see you waggling your foot, it really sounds like you just rubbed it into your ass. Now I'm stuck here with no wheel, a lost toolbox, and Mr. Fancy Cakes. Say! What? I'll bet a fine, strapping young man like you could help me fix up this wheel. Yep, you help me fix my chariot, and I'll give you a lift to the tournament. Can you, can you repeat that? Yes. Can you please go through that entire spiel again? Uh, could you repeat that? Try to keep up, son. Bridges out, failed shortcut, flying rock, wheel broke, be a strapping lad, get tools, fix wagon, get a lift to the tournament! I like this guy. He keeps things short and succinct when you ask him twice. Alright, what else can I do? I can talk to him some more, it looks like. Find me a wheel, boy. Anything big and round should do the trick. Got it. Alright, big and round. Deal. How about this hatchet? Can I just, just do this my own way? 
What happened to the rest of my tools? My wheel mending kit was in that toolbox. You expect me to fix this wheel with only a hatchet? Hatchets are for destroying, not for fixing. What kind of game are you playing here, boy? Oh, I know. Maybe I could use this blade to chisel a wheel out of driftwood. Or perhaps Okay, I, I get it. Don't uh, Don't rub it in. I was only trying to help. Stupid dream logic. Tell you what, you can keep my hatchet, but please bring me a real solution. You know, like a wheel, big, round, rolling, a wheel that goes here, like those. I like this guy. He talks like I do. And this gigantic wagon is being pulled by little guinea pig unicorns, and those horns appear to be strapped to their heads. Oh, can I pet your goats? Stay away from my majestic unicorns. Those are not unicorns. Those are goats. And that's a frog. All right, maybe this is the tree I need to chop down to make a bridge. Let's do it. That's a one powerful hatchet. All right, down it goes. And it's a dead tree, so even I don't feel guilty for knocking down a tree because it was already brown and rotty. Dun, dun, dun. That missing wheel had me stumped. I had to go out on a limb to get past the root of the problem. Ugh, Grandpa, your infamous puns are not my favorite. What's the matter? You don't like the timbre of my voice? Oh, that's a good one. Well done, Graham. Well played. The timber of my voice. That's amazing. Oh, there's things watching me. Where's my honeycomb? Where's my emeralds? All right, we have really changed gears in here. Hi. Is there anything in here? Oh, I can look at it. Here, kitty, kitty. Not a kitty, not a kitty. All right, lesson learned. Don't go running after strange animals in bushes. Don't go chasing waterfalls. Stick to the lakes and rivers that you're used to. The bridge is up, but there's no moat. Somebody really raked your door, guys. Think the dragon was here? <laughs> Graham, you're so useless. All right, can't do that, but this ivy looks right for the climbing. Huh. And just... Oh, okay, so you got a point in direction, and then hit space bar, and then you're good. Ah. Ah, there we go. Beautiful. Whoop. The town square was eerily quiet. Was I the only person in Daventry, not at the parade? There wasn't much of a parade either. There was only like six people. And one of them was very short, so I'm sure he only counted as half. <gasps> I can explore. There's like shops and towns and people and stuff. Well, no people. A bakery. And it smelled delicious. Oh, I wonder if the third chapter, if we'll go back to... Um, Oh, I forgot the name of the town, where we were. What's the name of the area? It starts with an S. Oh, you guys are going to hate me. I'm supposed to know all these things. Ah, uh -huh. I didn't see any reason why that stale bread really? wouldn't work for a wheel. What kind of... Where did you get this cape, Graham? I want to know. I want to call it Samaria. It's not Samaria. It's not Spielberg. And Serenia. Serenia, that's the one. That sign was asking for tips, and there was a metal pan to collect coins. Well, I mean, I guess I did take the bread. Let's be the honest. Let's do the honest thing. I decided to leave some coins for the bread. There you go. All right, there you go. I feel like I've, I feel like I've done right. I've done the king. I've done the. I, this is the king Swayze way. Let's see. It looks like there's another house up here we can go play around in. Hopefully, and they won't mind. Everyone seems to be gone, so this looks like the alchemist shop. I wonder why they don't lock up when they're not around. I stumbled upon some kind of curiosity mm. shop. It was a little collection tray with a sign asking for tips. So Daventry apparently runs on the honor system. I got a tip for you. The honor system doesn't work. Apparently nothing in here that Graham wants. Nothing seemed to be brewing yet. Nothing seemed to be brewing yet. Nothing seemed to be brewing yet. Wh what is that delivery, Nothing Chris? Nothing seemed to be brewing yet. <laughs> I promise to use that next time I'm cooking something. Nothing it's like, what's for dinner? Nothing seems to be ruined yet. Oh, I love it. This game makes me so happy. Just saved you from an eternity of damnation as a tree. King Graham over here. Where have you been all this time, my love? Um, oh, darling. Hero. Just take me home. Standing I'll in the water. You You're welcome, you ungrateful bitch! Unbelievable. Cedric, did you see that, my man? She just went up and left me without a buy your leave. 